And you can see in our Supreme Master Television, uh, animals, they're loving, so loving to, to animals and to, to other species of animals, not even their own species, yeah? Every time I see this on SMTV, I love this so much. And I wanted to go more on retreat to help them. Understand, it's, it's motivated me more. Or the same as if I see suffering, uh, animal suffering. Humans, we can think of the way to lessen the suffering. We can have medicine, we can have neighbors to help us because we can speak. Or if we can write, we say, I'm in need of help, we can call people. But animals, they are helpless. And they have been tortured, killed, maimed, mistreated every day in our so-called civilization. This is not civilization, it's barbarous, I'm thinking. I'm not even thinking, I know it is. How can we, strong, intelligent, powerful, harassing or torturing or taking advantage of a small, weak and helpless animals, even big ones like, like uh, cows or something, they are very docile, you know, because they know they practice endurance. They have more contact with heaven than many of the humans do. That's why they endure it. They could do something, but they chose not to. Most of the time they choose not to react or to revenge. But there is one, uh, this is one of the instances that I remember in the circus somewhere, the mother elephant finally revenged and hurt many humans around just because they, I think they were, they were uh, harassing her baby a little elephant to train, you know, they use very harsh and cruel uh, ways to train and to break the elephant, to subdue the elephants into obedience because they scare them so and they break them down. Very cruel, very cruel practice, I saw that. It hurt and it bleeds and it whip, they whip them or cut them, all kind of things and I don't know if if I'm living with humans or I'm living with beasts sometimes, some people make me think that I'm not living with humans, that I'm not living on earth, that I'm living in hell somewhere. Because even in humans' law, we only punish the bad ones, the criminals, the animals, they do nothing. There are no criminals. Why they have been subjected to such kind of, you know, was the nightmare, was an imagination kind of, of, of treatment. And it's still going on nowadays on our so-called civilized planet. If I don't think about that, then I still can, can live. If I keep thinking about that, I just don't want to stay here anymore. I don't know if humans, some humans or many humans are really worthy of any mercy or redemption. If I think about that, pardon my anger. I'm doing a lot more retreat nowadays whenever I can, okay? Be, be it three days, two days, one week, five days, one month, whatever I can, okay? So if you don't see me sometimes, uh, please don't try to pull me out by praying this and that and understand? Just let me do my job also, okay? My job is not only to teach you or entertain you, but my job is inside for other beings, okay? Not just this planet, other planet as well. You help me by meditating and wishing me success in my inner journey. And that's the best you can do. Got that? Okay?